another day, another dollar. So, so what do we have here, Philip? Um, well, let me give you today's news report. It's, uh, I don't even know what it is outside. It's like 60 degrees and, um, yeah, it's race yeah. morning. I guess we got the, the man's here. Got a pirate here. The, the one and only champion Greybeard is clearly making his way to the start line. I think today is going to be a rough day for competition. Um, the seas on the golf course going to be a little rough today. Well, so it looks like you placed somewhere. Oh yeah, I like barely made it first. That guy was like 30 seconds back. It's pretty amazing. Oh look, look at the kicks. That's it. Oh yeah. Where are you going? Where are you going? Oh. Where are you going? Oh. Yeah, that gets confusing for like the half marathon guys. No, that was such a good impulse decision to take the four miler. Oh my God. I didn't think this half marathon was gonna be a, a good idea at all. Just now, that was clutch. Oh, my left calf is gonna burn. Major toasty. Our male overall, Philip Latosha. What's up? Thank you. Okay, so this four mile race is done. And all I can say is that people in Florida are way too nice. I think I really enjoy that, like, a lot about Florida. Like, it's this tight-knit community for racing. Like, the guy in the half marathon who won the race, I guess he's uh, he's running Challenge Miami next week. Um, which is, like, what, a big triathlon in Miami. I'm going to try to live stream that while we're there. Unless you guys want to go to Miami next week, that'd be pretty sick. But I think it's going to be, like, crowded. I think I'll wrap up my video here though and give share final thoughts later. Um, like hours from now when the race is kind of like completed in my mind.